Today we're going to make a very reasonably priced meal for you and your family. I know I'm making it for mine tonight. It's just me and my husband, so I'm making it for two. But it's going to be a really quick and delicious dish. And it has all the vegetables and all of your proteins in it and uh, your uh, grain. So that'll make a wonderful dinner for uh, your family. And on top of that, it's easily adjustable. I'm making it for two in this recipe, but you can make it for three or four or however many you need just by adding more rice to it. So we're going to get right in there. So stay tuned for the recipe. Now we're ready to make our ground turkey and rice skillet and to the skillet we are going to add one pound of ground turkey that I bought from Walmart and it was only two dollars and forty eight cents for one pound. Now we are chopping up our ground turkey in this pan And as it cooks, we'll continue to chop to make sure it's finely chopped up. And we'll make sure that it's cooked thoroughly. Now that the turkey has cooked, thoroughly through. I'm just going to take a little bit of paper uh, napkin here and we're going to go around and kind of get some of this grease out of here. There's very little with lean, um, with your lean turkey. So there we go. We've got some nice ground turkey there. Cooked all the way through. Now to this, we're going to add um, two tables, or I'm sorry, two teaspoons of Italian seasoning. And we'll just probably have to take that off. Add a little bit to it. Okay. We're going to do a teaspoon of garlic powder. One teaspoon of salt, but I use pink Himalayan salt, so I'm just going to measure how much I think I need in there. And we're going to do half teaspoon of pepper. We can never have enough pepper, can we? I always add a little more because I love pepper so much. Okay, and then we're going to get our can of drained mixed vegetables. I got this at Walmart and it cost me 96 cents. Add those in. Also, we're going to add uh, one can of Italian style petite diced tomatoes. Now we're going to stir this all in. All right, and now that we've got that all stirred in, we're going to take um, the medium heat on our um, stove 
and simmer covered for about five minutes. So we're gonna do about a medium heat and just let that simmer for about five minutes. Now over here, I have my water boiling for my rice. I use jasmine rice and jasmine rice is a, um, I think the better of all rices but you use what you like or what you have on hand, but that is usually what I have. I'm bringing it up to boil, and I'm going to add to that my one cup of rice, because I'm making it for two. I'm going to give it a little bitty stir here. And then we're gonna cut this off over here, the, uh, the heat. And we're going to cut, uh, remove it, move it from the heat and wait about five minutes. Okay, now we're going to stir in our rice. It's been about five minutes, that's all it really needed. So we're going to stir that in. And we're going to give this a quick stir. Just look at all those vegetables, tomatoes, and the rice. And like I said, you could add more rice if you want to. But in this case, this is just fine for me and my husband. Now we're gonna let this simmer for about another three minutes, and then we're gonna be ready to serve. You can see this is our little plate of food here. So there you have it, dear friends. We have made a meal for a family of uh, four, well, for two for us, but if you added another cup of rice and another cup of water, you could make it a family of four. So until next time, we'll be cooking some other wonderful dishes for you and some very budget-friendly ones. This one cost me just a little over five dollars. It was five dollars and 26 cents and it's a wonderful meal to make and it's very budget-friendly. So thank you for watching. We'll see you next time.